you put yourself and you push yourself and you will yourself out and into nature. And there's no better, there's no better feeling I think that I've had in my life than to, than to be camped wild on an island. And you wake up, you set the alarm and you wake up uh, the hour before first light. After a while, you don't have to actually set your physical alarm anymore. You just tell yourself and your brain can, uh, can wake you up at the moment that you want. For me, it's an hour before first light. It takes an hour to, to, to get all your stuff, the tent down and all the stuff into the canoe. And then in the per that perfect moment, you push off, you push off into the water and, uh, and there's all the possibilities of the day ahead of you. And I know where I'm gonna, where I'm gonna get to. It's gonna, be, it's gonna be another island on a perfect day. And I'm gonna get there uh, in concert with, with Last Light. And um, the moment where you push yourself into the wild and you embrace the wildness around yourself and you embrace the wildness inside of yourself and you have to try to face uh, some of your demons. And in, in my case, from my childhood and, uh, and, and living and being perpetually on the go from the time I was a kid, I believe, um, I found peace and I found peace and tranquility with the water. There's the promise of that village. There's the promise of, of that campsite. There's the promise of the city and of the, the big iron bridges and humanity, and the honking, and the, uh, and the sirens. And um, on the water, there's times when you have to heave ho. And you heave ho to get to that town. You heave ho to get to that friendship and that story. And um, in the best of times, the paddling goes hand in hand with really inspirational and, uh, and fine storytelling. And um, when you add us all up, the idea for the, the group paddle today, when you add us all up, together, when you look around us, we are strong. And when you look around us and you listen to some of the stories that I've been listening to, we are so strong. And, 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 and there's this power when we come together for a common cause, for a common good. For me, my cause is I've been an expatriate for so long, I wanted to see the country. And I wanted to see the country up close and personal. And I wanted to be able to touch it and to, and to feel it and, and to meet people and, and, and to, to hear the real stories from the real people in the middle of America. And it's not about New York City. It's about the right here and the right now. It's about everywhere in between. Where I've come from, from Story, Oregon, right here to Manhattan. It's about us. And uh, tonight is a celebration, I like to think, of friendship. It's a celebration of paddling. And I'm so, I'm so lucky to have so many friends and so many paddling friends as well. And um, I just, uh, I'm so happy, I'm so happy I can hardly stand. Uh, <laughs> yay! <laughs> Thank you all very much. Thank you. Bravo! <laughs>